Hello, beautiful friends. Hello. <sighs> Can we be grateful for this beautiful day? And every day is a beautiful day. So, the full moon in Capricorn, right? It has been calling, right? It has been calling. And we are receiving the messages. And... I believe it's also called the strawberry moon and I saw it yesterday and it definitely it, it's getting its color <laughs> but what the full moon in Capricorn brings to us is about the act of love right a lot of emotional healing is gonna be happening it is happening a lot of emotional release you know healing the union healing the connection within yourself letting go of what holds you back what keeps you away from your happiness is it your ego old beliefs old ways of thinking old ways of perceiving things and the moon is really leading you to your true north which is the true self to go near a water this is a vision that i am having it, it's go near water where there is sand now you can also imagine yourself doing this and it will be potent as well and you are wearing white right it's all loose the clothes is loose there's a wind right and you are looking at the sunset, okay? Allowing it to help you on your release of old habits. People can change, you can change. The sun will give you the strength to move forward in your life. The sun will give you inner knowing of the true love, happiness is within you. You know, one of the other uh, images that I am having is of you being hugged, but resisting it. Allow to be the parent for yourself that you never had. Allow yourself to see life with different eyes. You are purity. Let yourself see that and start breaking barriers that keep you from seeing the light. I would really like you to do something for yourself, for you, for you. One of the other things that really has um, been called to is lavender. So you can use lavender in a way that is profound to you. Uh, copal um, that has also been called to me and usually I do copal incense and that just helps to give the gratitude and to really harmonize my environment and one of the other things that was brought to my attention uh, is about releasing right so really releasing and transmuting so I know that a lot of us, we know how to release would be, you know, burning the a paper, right? Write down what you want to release and then just burn it. But one of the things that I was called to say would be getting a balloon, right? That has helium, right? Because it's going to go to the sky, up in the sky, and attach a note, now, this note can be what you want to release, what you want to let go, and basically there's going to be, yes, I was talking about the balloon, right, and attaching a note to it, and that's how we transmute any old residue not so 
good experience, right? And we will just release it to the heavens. And when you do that, you will feel so uplifted and so connected. And knowing that, you know, this is something that you really were wanting to, like, take off your chest, right? And this is a brand new way of releasing the old, releasing any painful or any resistance, right? It's all about you at this point. It has always been about you. But with the full moon in Capricorn, it's really uh, amplifying that to you. All right, my beautiful friends. Much love to you guys. And remember, when you're called, you're called. And when you are, uh, act upon it. Remember, it's about the act of love, the act of your love within yourself. All right. Namaste.